how to make a solar charger when the world has ended, and more importantly, why would you need it? The grid is a fairy tale, batteries are antiques, and your radio is whispering for mercy. You need to keep a light on and a radio alive without begging a looter. Time to steal sunbeams and glue them together. Start by scavenging tiny solar panels from dead garden lights, faded calculators, or that rooftop that used to be someone's pride. Peel, wire, and tape them like you're repairing a heart. Copper from a broken charger becomes your conductor. Plastic shards or glass make a rude shelter. And a scrap plank props the whole contraption toward the sun. Link cells until the little LED in your pocket blinks with gratitude, then creep a wire to the battery terminals and pray to whatever deity handles duct tape. If it spits sparks, swear with emphasis. If it smokes, back away and try again. Science. Photons hit silicon, electrons move, and current flows. More cells in series, more voltage, more parallel, longer life. Result. Junk becomes steady charge. If the battery wakes up, congrats. You MacGyvered daylight into electricity. Welcome to survival, now with less whining.